so as I was saying, this is my Ritalin and then this is <clears throat> Ketorolac, which is just like a pain medication that I often take. Really I don't need both of these bottles because I know what they do, um, so I'm going to transfer them into this bottle. These medications were when I was traveling for a bit, but I think I can just put them in the same container because they are vastly different pills. Alright, so let me just dump this out actually. There's a lot of there's a lot of stuff in here. This is just a package of sticky notes that I keep in here for marking pages. That's gonna stay inside. I'm just gonna push that to the bottom. And I love this pen, but the finding the refills are so difficult. And I've been using up them too, like they're literally empty. And I'm keeping the empty pens, which I know sounds kind of weird right now, um, until I can find an easier replacement. But for now, I've switched over to the Sarasa Gel 0.7, and I know where to find the refills which is really helpful and I just find that they write pretty much exactly the same so I think I'm just gonna honestly switch over to Sarasa even though I do like the Ink Joys um yeah I also have the Sarasa 0 0.5 that's going to be keeping this as I believe oh it was rubbed off but it's like the lilac color and that's just gonna be going in here I'm just gonna try to keep that there so then it's in uh, pink sticky notes, super helpful, usually just for writing notes to myself. I love the pastel colors, they're just easier to see for me, like my eyes honestly. Clear ruler, love this, still gonna keep it. This used to house my Samsung um, earbuds, but really I don't have I don't use those earbuds anymore, I just use wireless ones, so I think that's just going to go in my side drawer so I can use it for something else, or if something comes up, then I can use it. I don't use this. Um, this, this, and this. These were just replacements for my black pen. Actually, this is also going to be the same thing, too. These were all replacements I was going to be using. Um, I only needed it for one class. So, I don't really need any of these because I found that the Sarasa works amazing. So, I'm just going to put these away at some other point. Um, this is in here as my USB-C adapter from micro USB to USB-C for my phone. Because my regular charger for, like, my tablet... And my headphones, all that kind of stuff, is micro USB. So I just keep it in my electronics bag that I keep in my, my um, oh gosh, my backpack, which is a Wonder Woman pouch that I got at a convention from a, what's it called? A, like a, a store that actually sells capes for cats. Like that's literally like their brand. Um, so yeah, that's just going in there. I have two sets of this nailing extra, like, ultra quick nail glue. One is completely dried out and I keep forgetting to throw away the bad one. This one is completely dry. Okay, so this one, this one is fine. So this can go in here just because I know I'm going to forget. So the one that's out, I'm going to throw away. That's fine. This is my Adonit. Jot Mini, I believe. Yeah, the Jot Mini. It's just a precision stylus. And I use it for my tablet if I'm taking notes. I haven't really been um, taking notes on my tablet lately, but I really like having this around just in case. Super handy. Um, then I have a Kingston 32 gigabyte USB stick. which And then an 8 gigabyte Lexar. I think I'm going to keep the 8 gigabyte in my desk still. At one point I did need a bunch of USBs for a lab 
that I was doing in the intercession term, which is six weeks at the beginning of the summer term. Um, what did this just say? Oh, this is a sticky note from a while ago that says, I'm building a dungeon for our campaign. I haven't actually managed to do that yet, but that's fine. That's going to be thrown out as well. Um, if you didn't know, I play D&D. So, yeah. I also just really want to show off my nails today. So that's why also I wanted to do this video. But also I really needed to clean this up. Like, it was getting really bad. Like, I couldn't actually do anything with it. Why do I have three pencils? Let's see how full they are. This one's almost empty, so I'm gonna keep this one. This one's like full. This one's gonna stay at home until I need it. And then this one I've been using recently for testing. So just, I like having two pencils just in case. There's always a quiz or something that I'll need it for. Why do I have so many? Okay, Sharpie pen I just like to have. It's just a fine liner. I believe it's 0 0.8 millimeters, but anyway, it's just really good. I like having a fine liner around, especially for doing summary notes. It's excellent. Um, I have, why do I have two of these in my bag? I have no idea. I'm going to take the one that's less full. These are um, my favorite fine black ballpoint pen. I now am a, I'm a convert over to uh, gel. Just because I find it's super dark and pigmented, which is really nice, but this is still a really nice pen if I really don't want it to bleed through the paper. That's just gonna go in my desk. This is handy. I got it at a surplus store in town and literally it just like props up your phone. Like literally just props up your phone, which I just find is helpful um, if I'm eating lunch and I only have like my uh, phone with me. I like to watch things. I only really carry around two highlighters. These are both the mild liners and yeah it's the lighter purple and the lighter gray and they're dual tip so it's the jizzle chisel tip and the fine point. I really only use the chisel tip but I like having two highlighters just in case. Um, if I'm doing like definitions and just important information blah 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 blah. It's not super important but I really do enjoy the ink joy colors. I also just find that they write super nicely, especially the purple one. The purple one is really, really good. Pink's also great. The blue, I'm not super impressed with. It honestly, I find that light blue is just a hard ink to write with. I like having all of these. I know it seems a little bit excessive, but I just like them. And I'm just going to keep this Bic Atlantis exact at home for my personal note, like for notes and stuff. This is also a really, really great um, style of fine tip ballpoint. I love, I have pretty much, yeah, like I have a bunch of the exacts. Like I ran out of the red and the black because they just impressed me so much. This blue is really, really nice to work with. Again, the blue, the like teal color is just not easy to work with, but I do like using them at home. Yeah. I have this e.l.f. Ravishing Rose lipstick in here. I feel like I always have a lipstick or a lip balm in here. It's a really nice, a really nice one. Um, and what's really interesting is that the bottom comes off and it's a lip, it's a lip balm. It's just my, <laughs> my nails are a little bit too long for that, but once, oh, that was a terrible swatch. It's kind of hard. It's like a lip balm, but anyway, it's very difficult to swatch when you have really long nails and you don't want to get any color on them. But yeah, I'm going to put this back with my, um, my other lipsticks. And yeah, this one I find, like the lip balm I don't use because it's just, it's not super great quality. Um, I don't really use whiteout anymore. I just kind of cross stuff out, but if I am running an equation, for instance, I will use whiteout because otherwise it'll get like super messy and will not read properly. Um, and I also have this cat one, which I just think is super cute, honestly. I got it from a, oh my gosh, I think it's just an Asian supermarket. And 
they sold stationery, which is kind of interesting to me. But yeah, I think it's just super cute. It makes me smile to look at, so I'm just going to keep it in here, even though I don't really use it. Um, I just think it's the cutest thing. And then this will also be in here. I'm trying to think if there's anything else that really should go in here. Yeah, I don't think so. Yeah, I think this is really all I need on a daily basis. And really, it's not, it's not too much stuff when you consider, like, my life, I guess. Like, it's pretty... Now it's all squishy, and it's exactly the amount that I, I wanted it to be at the end of this. And, yeah, I just needed a really good declutter, which has been achieved. But, yeah, pretty much this is the basics of what I will carry around most days. Um, and I'm just kind of characteristic by the sound of shaking pills, honestly. Every time I take out my pencil case, it's always a shaking of pills. It's just, it's kind of funny. A little sad, but kind of funny as well. But anyway, thanks for watching um, my decluttering of my pencil case.